It's Monday. Now it's time to get back on track on things. Let's look at the board. I'm not gonna lie, I really am lazy to do the wires. I do have a friend that asked me to fix some of his wires for his LED strip, so I'm also gonna be doing that. Okay, so I've been brainstorming on how I'm gonna set up the LED strips for my friend's window on the posing yogurt shop. I will need to be soldering. I feel like I said that weird. I will need to solder wire. And I'm debating if I should go with stranded core wire or solid core wire. You need to solder four wires for this kind of LED strip. I need four different colors, but at the same time, I don't want to order more wire when I have all these wires. Unless I just order one. See, my problem is, is like I get in that mood and like I wanted to get things done now. That I don't know if I should stop and think and actually order another one. This is my life. These are my problems. I'm gonna order another wire. This is, I have to. There's too many jumps. I don't want to get confused. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm just figuring out how I'm going to set this circuit up. Cool beans. Cool beans. Good morning. Isn't life so amazing? I'm not going to lie. After finishing my Infinity Door project, even though I still need to do the backside, I need to cover the gaps with um, trim. Wait, what is that called? Why do I always forget what things are called? And then paint it, maybe add texture, I don't know. But after finishing that, I kind of feel like I don't know what to do with my life. I feel like I could relate this to people that binge watch a show and then it ends. And it's like, well, what do I do now? What is my existence for? Literally how I feel right now. So I'm just trying to get back in the groove of like grinding and stuff. I know I still need to do some things like the wires and stuff, but I just feel so like... What do I do? But I guess I'll just keep you updated. Right now we're just gonna go donate the TV. I'm waiting for my boyfriend to get here because he has a truck. And then we'll see what I do from there. All right, so nobody wanted my TV. I had a full day of trying to figure out where to leave this damn TV and nobody wanted it. I still have it. Me and my boyfriend had a crazy day. Nobody wanted our free TV. But I'm home now and I'm gonna start editing my business cards. I was going to wait till I finished my website, but as if you've been following along, you could see that I get a little distracted, so making my website just kind of becomes this like back burner project that I come to every now and then. I'm going to just do the business cards because I need that sooner than the website. That's what I'm doing today. And then later on, I'm planning on working on the wires for the frozen penguin. Fun, 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 fun. So I'm trying to experiment on my logo here. But yeah, this is my design so far. I don't know if I like it or not. Good morning. So I feel like I'm getting to a point where I have no idea what I'm doing with these vlogs. But I'm trying to update and then at the same time, I'm like doing things that I feel like don't really need to be updated on. Okay, I know I have like a whole bunch of things I should be doing. I actually looked at my board and like I should be doing all that stuff up there, but... <sighs> I think the thing also is like, just the thought that I have to do those things is what makes me not want to do it. What is that? Like, like what is wrong with me? Okay, so as far as the wires go from my light, I need to figure out how I'm gonna put the lights because I do want to add another one over there, over there. I guess I should order the things for the frozen penguin wires because I kind of need that soon, sooner than later. I'll do that first then. I try to prioritize, I try to see what's more important. I can't find my heat shrink tubing. Oh, it's right here. Wow, it was next to my camera. <laughs> Gee willikers, I need to get it together. Okay, I decided I am going to work on the wires and before I order stuff, I'm going to just make sure I am going to go the solid core route. I hear solid carries more current, so that's pretty cool. Now to get to work. Okay, we got our first solder done. I just wrapped it against the solid wire and now I'm just going to cover it with the heat shrink tubing because I do not want these to make contact with the other wires. All right, I just ordered my wires so I can wait till that comes in so I can continue this project. 
You want to be in my vlog? Huh? You want to be in my vlog? Vlog? Yes. Vlog. You want to be in my video? You don't want to be in my video? No. So, so they can meet you. The zero views I get. <laughs> my wires came in. So we are gonna dye my boyfriend's hair. Say hi, boyfriend. He says hi. <laughs> Where are you? Oops. Oops. Cool. Why do you put the instructions? If I'm bored, you know why. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Mix one part bleach and two parts developer. Okay, one ounce. We should, no, this Diarrhea. one. Diarrhea. Whoa. Oh my god, it's six ounces. Wait, I'm count I'm doing this wrong. I'm doing point six. It's supposed to be one. Ha. Huh. I messed up. Okay then. We're going on guess now. I'm Why is it not changing weight? Oh no, I'm being bored. <laughs> Fine, we're gonna put everything in. Put everything Wait, in. Wait, no. Don't put everything Hold in. Hold on, I'm doing math. I can't do math right now. Just toss everything in until you're gonna record and do this. To put everything in. Okay, one ounce oh, minus. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know what kind of math you're doing. Okay. Come on. I just see you grabbing onto that and nothing coming out. Alright, we're at 1.7 with the cup. Okay, what I'm gonna do is. Put everything in. I'm gonna subtract this. No, just put everything in. Just put everything in. No, just it. It's 0.3. This weighs 0.3 ounces. So we have to subtract 0.3. So we have 1.4. What about the one you put in? You put in one too? We have 1.4 right now. I'm just gonna, okay, I'm just gonna add everything in there. <laughs> I wish you could see the face folks. Is this really scary? Let me put a towel on. We're only doing like part of your hair. Okay, go this way. I need to see the light. Okay, it's touching your hair, so the process has begun. New side hustle, bleaching hair. If you see my hair fall off, don't come. <laughs> you already saw how I was able to just scale. <laughs> go. No! You're not supposed to touch your skin. Come here. <laughs> Your look hair is gonna be bleached. <laughs> I'm an artiste. Everything I do is art. I don't know if it's too much. Should I do my hair? There's still like a lot of bleach left. Look at it's full. Okay, I'm gonna try to do my hair, I guess. So I'm gonna do a little part of my hair. I think I'm just gonna do this part. You gonna do it yourself? No, you can do it. Okay. All right, my boyfriend's gonna dye my hair this time. So before my boyfriend, I never dyed my hair before, and I never cared to dye my hair, and I kind of still don't. But since we don't like to be wasteful here, and I like to experiment with my hair, I said might as well dye it. So I don't know what I'm listening to, but then I went to random Japanese music. So if I go boss, you go ball with me. Show me the hair. You want to say bye? <laughs> Stop recording already. Okay, I'm leaving. Stop recording! <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding, I was recording. I know you were. Okay, say bye. He says bye. <laughs> Alright, y'all, I'm gonna have to end the vlog here. So, I have to be honest, I feel like these past two weeks were really weird. Like, I didn't even know how to vlog this week. Or the week before that if i'm being honest i feel like i'm still kind of coming back to myself like i think i feel this way because i mean my job just ended and i finished my door project i wasn't working on it that that long it was still long enough to be like it kind of became a routine and same with work it just kind of became a routine of like going to work even though it's not a set schedule or anything and like i'm kind of still all over the place it still feels like it's part of my daily life for that temporary time since i do this a lot with like freelancing and stuff like i'm working on something temporarily at a time but that's my focus 
is that when that ends, it's kind of hard for me to like bounce back, kind of like go on with life because it just feels like I feel like I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, it feels like I'm lost, even though I know I what to work on. I just feel like I need to just stop and take everything in of what just happened. My whole work experience and working on the door, like I just need to take it in before I just run off and keep doing stuff. I don't know, that's kind of how I'm just trying to internalize it, interpret it. So I'm trying to be patient with myself because the things I've learned about myself throughout the years is that I burn out easily and um, some burnouts are bigger than others. And also, I lose myself very often. I get very lost and I, it's just something I've been dealing with throughout the years. Ever since I took on the journey of taking the leap of faith and quitting my job and trying to pursue whatever it is I want to pursue. And it's kind of all over the place when I constantly change my mind on things and when I constantly get distracted and and hyper focus on different things. It's quite a crazy journey, but I feel like no matter what, I'm still following my intuition and my heart. So it, it makes it fun. And I can feel lost even if things are going great. Like I have a performance coming up, I have a project. Like I'm blessed and I'm honestly grateful for my life. And I feel like everything's going amazing. I'm so grateful, I'm fortunate. I have so much abundance, yeah. I still get into those feeling lost moments. Yeah, just gotta be patient with myself. Alright, I'm gonna call it because I don't know what this vlog was. It was not like the other ones. Alright, peace out.